Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Remnant from the Ashes on Nightmare Mode with a new character. Yeah. Walk through. So, we're gonna begin by getting that yeah. mod from the uh, boss that we just time. killed, Seed Killer. Summon a Root Hollow that deals 20 damage per hit, lasts 30 seconds. I'll try this out for a little bit anyway, might as well. Okay, so I'm gonna buy a Scrapper Helmet for now. I can't really buy the body and it's Be yet because I'm broke as fuck. So what we're going to do now is head to um, the very beginning of the game, where we're going to get the Drifter armor. Okay, so teleport to Founder's Hideout, the very first um, place in the game, and cl cl climb up the stairs here. This is where we're going to get our Drifter's armor, so let's break this down, crawl under here, and go up here. This is this little secret area. There's some scraps in these boxes, because I'm broke as fuck. And grab this iron and grab this. There we go. So let's see what this does. It's probably gonna add quite a little bit of weight to it. So yeah, it negative 35% stamina usage when you put the whole set on, but I'm not actually gonna use it, I'm just gonna keep it. Okay, so this was my last checkpoint here. I'm gonna show you guys where I came from. So basically this uh shortcut over here, I opened the door after I defeated the boss. So this way was the uh the Mangler boss went up here, opened the door, and there's my checkpoint here. So now I need to explore this area around here and see if there's anything. It looks like there is because we have a. I've never been through this um, through this section yet, so I'll go through here and, and see if there's another boss or area that I haven't explored. Okay, so I just trusted the checkpoint. Just came out of there. So we're gonna proceed this area here. Now what? So I haven't explored this area yet. Get this guy. Back off from that guy. Whoa, whoa. Didn't even notice him. I need to put that scrapper armor on, but I don't have enough coins or scrap yet. So we're gonna have to find lots of scrap. So I'm probably gonna break lots of everything to get scraps. Slide and bam. Dead. I might just go back to my rifle actually. I don't even know why I'm using the shotgun, to be honest. Right I should go back to the, to the uh, rifle right now. Actually, I guess I'll just keep a shotgun, I mean, that was rough. I'm owning with it, so I might as well. Don't really see why I should go to the rifle when I'm killing everything in one hit, anyway, with this thing. As long as I get enough range on them. Oh, this might be it! Yeah! Oh no, that might be... The Magnum that I've been looking for this whole time. The quest item for it, I think that's it. I don't know what else it would be. So let me try summoning this stuff. These are the little roots here. And they're gonna be our friends. Wow, they're owning! <laughs> yeah! Oh no! Get him, roots! Nice! Dude, these little guys are freaking owning, man. Monkey key. Oh, that's not it. That's not it. Never. Oh, I'm shooting my own loot. Oh my god. <laughs> I just shot my own little root friends. I should probably put down my main gun. They're actually pretty useful. Okay, so we got the monkey key, which is going to get us the assault rifle, I think. Oh, that means I still haven't found the magnum. Oh, that's not good. The quest item for the magnum. Still going to find that somewhere in Earth. 
but I don't know if I'm gonna find it to be honest. I mean, I've, I'm running out of places to look. Around here, maybe we'll find the quest item here. Probably not. At least we'll get scraps though. Oh, we found something. No, that's a tome. Just a tome to get the tree. I'll put a couple points into Vigor. I'm like four levels off from Max and Vigor. And then I won't be able to put any any more into it. health. Okay, so this is the end of it. And what's back here? This is the monkey key, right? Yeah, so the monkey key is gonna open this door here. Once it gives me the option. And we get another trait and quest complete experience. Alright, so let's see what we get. Uh, we should get the assault rifle, I think. Or wait, or maybe it's the hunting pistol. No, it's the assault rifle. Alright, so let's check that out. Assault rifle plus four. So that's what we got right here, assault rifle plus four. And that's all for this area, so that means that... Uh, I still haven't found the magnum. The uh, quest line for the magnum. And I don't know if I'm ever going to. Okay, so I just entered the area after I beat the Singe boss from episode 4, I believe it was. So we're just gonna head straight down here now and see... I think this might be the end of the game. Unless there's one more boss before the end of the game. I mean, uh, sorry, I think this might be the end of Earth. Nope, yep. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so this is the end of Earth, uh, not the end of the game. And I haven't found the quest item for the Magnum, so I'm not going to keep uh, looking for it. I'm just going to... We're just going to proceed to the next planet now, which is, I think, Rom, I think it's pronounced. First, we enter the Labyrinth, and then we just head straight up. We have to talk to this guy first, though. So I'm going to skip the text on this guy, or actually, we can listen in if you want to hear what he says. If Cracks not, just skip the video. Grow every day surrounding me. Human, the core is rotten. The root corrupts everything. Why do you distract the keeper? Hmm. Insignificant. Chance of success negligible. The guardians are destroyed. The devourer lurks unchecked. The labyrinth erodes daily. And I can behold the tide. On the other hand, your journey is not guaranteed to fail. Very well. Enter and see. The labyrinth holds all doors and infinite possibilities. If the path you require exists, it lies within. This is the maximum help I can provide at the moment. All endeavors will fail if I do any more. Okay, so this is the labyrinth that you just teleport us to, and it, it just makes steps for us while we travel through it. Uh, we come back here later in the game to go to a different uh, planet. And we just got a new trait. Bless. Keeper's Blessing Elemental Resistance. So it just he keeps heading straight. I'm not going to even bother resting at the uh, checkpoint there because we're going to get one in the, in the next planet anyway. So just keep heading all the way straight down. And we, we are officially done with Earth. New area. Oh. Good 
great king. I did not expect... You? You are not he. Yet you have opened the gates. A second Nui? It must be. For your sublime feet honor the sands of the eastern wind, itinerant one. Whatever your purpose, we are blessed by your presence. Surely there are none like you, inimitable one. At least I have never seen your like. I know none of that name or description. There is one who might know, but uh, he is not one to give information willingly. Except, perhaps, to another Nui. Yes, yes. Perhaps you are the one after all. You seek Aslan, the Undying King. But I warn you, challenging him will not be easy. Take caution. Go well, Enlightened One. Okay. Here's our checkpoint. Okay guys, so I'm gonna keep this episode short because we did get the assault rifle. And we ended Earth. So, we're gonna start fresh on this uh, new planet here in the next episode. And... Thanks for watching.